So for many teams, managing workload and how much your team is working on at different times can be one of the most difficult things. You want to maximise how much your team is working, but not overload them. You want to get that fine balance in between them. So there is a feature inside of ClickUp that you can use to optimise that, and that's called Workload View. And you can add it to any of the areas that you create inside of ClickUp, which means that you can see how much capacity your team is taking on and modify that, making sure that you unblock stuff. So this feature is pretty decent for managers. So to start, you need to have this activated on your account. So you have to add this view inside of and view and naturally choose workload. Now you'll naturally need to have a few people in your account. And of course, once you've added those people, you can see it in that view. I'll include an outline of what's included in the free plans and the enterprise plans for ClickUp. So inside of this view, you can choose how you want to view your workload. So for example, you can have this based on different formats of effort load. That could be based on time, because if you're working like on a consultancy basis, you don't want to overload somebody's time. You can base it on tasks, which is how many set amount of tasks per estimate, etc. And the points in that's a click app extension that is more suitable for sprint based point stuff. And finally, you can have a custom fields if you want to track it based on a different type of capacity. From here, you can choose the amount of capacity you have for a set person that you've assigned stuff to. So if it's hours, you can set it 40 hours. If it's uh, a certain amount of time for a part-time, it could be 20 hours, for example. And finally, you can divide that evenly across Monday to Friday, at what works suitably for each person. You can do that with tasks as well and how much you want the capacity to. And on this view, you'll be able to see indicators where people are overloaded in certain areas. So this is better for when you've really plotted out all the tasks for the week and then you come back to this and you're able to see, okay, I've overloaded this person with the amount of work. So workload view is a pretty helpful one for being able to uh, really dive into how much you and your team have got on their plate and whether to distribute your resources elsewhere and to distribute them on a higher level view. You can also set this to private mode if you do want to, to make life a lot easier. Thank you very much, and I hope you found this helpful. If you want to subscribe to Keep Productive with ClickUp, it'd be great to have you. We'll see you in a future video. Cheerio.